everybody, this is SW Chris. I'm from SW City, and welcome to the visual guide to Minecraft Particles. Now, this is going to be a qu pretty quick video. What I'm going to do is go into a montage here in just a quick second of showing you each of the particles uh, by type, um, just for about five seconds or so, and they'll just fade from one to the next. But a couple things to keep in mind as you do this. The particle names are case sensitive, so pay attention to the use of capital letters in the particle name. And then at the end of the montage, there are three special case, special use case particles, and two of those are going to behave differently. And I'll explain those at the end of the video. So let's get started. Okay, now the first special use case particle is the footstep. Now this is intended for footsteps. It, it acts normally just like all the other particles, but you know, it's intended for that basic use. And so I've set it up just like that. And so the particles spawn on my player um, and they basically uh, follow me around. And this is, they also float in the air. So it's a little weird, but uh, let me show you the code really quick in case you are interested. Uh, this is the, uh, the right foot, I believe. And this is the left foot, I believe. Now, this is not a perfect uh, version of this. You can tweak it and make it better um, because uh, the spawning is a little odd, as you can kind of see some of the footsteps overlap when your feet obviously don't overlap. All right, we'll move on to the next. And now the first of the two particles that do not behave like any of the other particles is the suspended particle. Now let's go ahead and turn this on. Now the reason it doesn't act like all the others is because it's an underwater particle. 
basically what happens is it only works underwater. That's the only thing that's different about it. And you can kind of see these suspended particles showing up here. Let's see if I can uh, get rid of the sign, uh, the text box for you. And that's basically how it looks. Now let's go look at the other use uh, of particle. Um, the other particle is the bubble particle. Now, bubble, B-U-B-B-L-E. And the bubble particle behaves the same exact way. You can see a bunch of bubbles showing up. Now I have it creating a lot more bubbles than it usually does. And they're spawning on my player, so that's why they're following me around a little bit. You don't have to have them spawn on my player. The only thing is that it's just that they only work when you're underwater. That's the only time they show up. And uh, that is it. So, anyways, if you liked this video, please uh, subscribe and give it a like. I really appreciate any support you can give. Um, I do snapshot videos every week, uh, at least every snapshot Thursday. And I try to get them out on time, but I have two jobs, and so that makes it kind of hard to sometimes get them out on the same day. Uh, I always try to do something a little different like this visual dictionary guide in that, uh, you know, they uh, <laughs> I don't do a snapshot overview all the time. Uh, sometimes it's just things like this uh, that I think will be more helpful after the snapshots are, are done and gone. So uh, anyways, thank you very much for watching this video, and we will catch you later. See you later. Hasta la vista. Auf Wiedersehen. Arrivederci. Hasta la vista. Goodbye.